You guys, Tom and I are going to have a blood pressure off. We'll only show you the blood pressure if it's any good. Let's do that again. I have to do it three times. Oh. What? It's going to be 147. 118 over 61. So 120. Well, up for a blood pressure reading. 130 is average. No medication or nothing. Just pure Scottish beef, mate. 130 is average. No, it's not. Yeah, because you have to take 130, 122, 118. Yes, you have to take an average. You can't just say the lowest one. 126 average. Okay, 1267. Oh look at that! Check it. Look at that. you can't hide that. He's. I'm just fit even when I'm training. I've got a gym and uh, got a gym. Mate. I, I ran down here as well. So. Five k running. You parked right? across the road. I've seen it. Does it rev up? Does it? Health as well. How's it sit? That's why mine's a bit higher. Oh, in the one twenties. Look at that. That's what you call mine's, Mr. Mine's Mr. Con so I went one money. Mr. Consistent. <laughs> It is event day today, so we are just having a wee quick, quick bite to eat. Get it down here. Last one. Come on, Tom. Come on. Woo! Sure. Woo! Hey, Tom, we need to back up. There's, there's the 300 aggressive lecturer. <laughs> Hi well, guys, we are at the UHI College. The first time I've been in this new college, so it's uh, pretty, pretty cool. Um, I'm going to be doing a wee talk for all the staff today of uh, working together as a team. Obviously, as staff members, you need to have a good team, and I've got a good team around me, so we're going to do some of that stuff. Yeah, so it's another episode three of, of uh, keeping up with the Stoltzmans, not the Kardashians. So yeah, uni, and then we're going to go and do some fun stuff at my house, and then we're going to go and do the most important thing. Train. I had actually one of my best raw deadlift sessions yesterday on that, so flew straight home from Munich, got an energy drink down my throat, had a sandwich, and then I just went and pulled something big, so it was good, very good, so all good. Looking ahead, what's your next challenge and how do you see motivated for them? I mean, it's to get another three of them on the table, yeah. <laughs> when, you, when, you, when, you, when you won one World Soros Man, you get that kind of bug of you want to keep winning more and more. And all I wanted to do was focus on winning the first one. But now, because I won three, you know, I'm only 30 years old. Marius Puskonowski's won it five times, a Polish guy. And, you know, I don't see why not. I can't win it another three times because uh, I don't want to be doing this for the rest of my life. But I think 30 years old, three trophies, do it another five or six years and take another three and then, you know, to be the greatest strongman of all time, like I said, from the high wind from Vergordon and it would be amazing for the community and just amazing for myself. But yeah, let's uh, let's get next year out of the way and see what happens. But it's just trying to just win as many titles as I can and just keep on living the dream that I am right now because, you know, I'm, like I said, from the high winds, great community around me, great team around me and it's just lucky that I'm, you know, this 10-year-old boy that got diagnosed with autism to be able to stand on the stage now and, you know, to win titles, to talk to people and just to kind of live my life and put this message out there that you know you can do anything you want in your life if you put your mind to it and you have the right people around you. Yeah, oh, so 
Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. I'll take another one. Stay spicy. Stay spicy. Noodle spicy. Yeah, buddy. That was a uh, that was a weird looking look. Stop! We want it on the chair. Eh? <laughs> um, but see, that was an amazing bit of talking. That was absolutely fantastic. The difference from when you get, uh, when, when you were young. The confidence is brilliant. So. I don't know that. I remember. I'm going to have beef lasagna. The chips, garlic bread, and then I'm gonna have. Like Tom, what are you get for food? BLT with chips. Tea gym meal. Something different. I want to try something different. So. So guys. The UHI thing's done, food's done. Say, put some stuff out for the dump. We're going to put this in, get some more bags, go to a charity shop and just get rid of basically junk that these guys left and we don't need. Oh, are you actually struggling? Nah. <laughs> hey, <laughs> another dump run, done and dusted. Right guys, so back from WWE and Munich. WWE was sensational, as you've probably seen. Did a few things with Drew McIntyre. Three, two, one. Yes! Reigning world's strongest man. We are all huge fans of this guy. Met some of the wrestlers, had the best seats in the house, so unbelievable. Relived my childhood and then flew over to Germany and did some stuff with uh, Compton and Smart, so it was very, very good as well. Late night at the Euros, check it out on BBC iPlayer. Now I'm back home, back to reality, back to dump runs, back to training, and back to sorting my house and garden. Hey, hey stay spicy, see you soon. Mm -hmm. Right, guys, so back at it, trying to sort the house out as much as we can, get some food, play FIFA, Scotland versus Hungary, stay tuned for why, then train some squats, then that'll be done for the night. Do you like rain? Because I like rain. You can guess how many cans of rain is here. I'll give you a crate. There's ten. I'll put all the charity stuff stuff in the back. Hey, she's stuck. Get down there. I'll take your telly. Me. What am I supposed to do with the TV? I don't know. Shit, you're so small compared to the car. <laughs> That's when you know you've made it when you start throwing away TVs. Here we go. Any cherries on you? Piss off, man. Guys, so we are in the office. Um, the last game of Scotland is going to be Scotland versus Hungary. So we got FIFA out, and it's going to be me versus Scotland versus Tom Hungary. Yeah, enjoy it, and uh, let's see who wins. May the best man win. This is weird. On top, best in practice. Attack. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Just like that. Possession, passing means nothing. Do you want to give a footy after score goals? Which is 
Can't get a match with mine. That's now. an excellent goal. One more. Oh, come on. Oh, that's off. Can they make something of it? And now waiting to pass. How is that not offside? Oh, I played the bit. I played on the line. He's got a shot with. Oh, lovely. It's just, 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 just. What a ball, a ball. to make it three. Where is it? Save, huh? Let's see this. That's How did that not go in? Bounced around. And it bounced. I thought this went in, Luke. <laughs> goal. That was a lucky goal. Lucky. lucky. I freaking Let's grab that out. Great defence. Oh. Right. oh. <laughs> I'm about to break the squash out. Move on. No, he's off. No, he's not. He's playing on. Move on. Keeper. Final moments. Offside, no, you have to do What are you doing? <laughs> Stupid right back. Oh, Charlton. Out of nowhere. Do you absolutely finish it? Oh! And there's the delivery. That's it. And that will be it for this game. It's a win for Scotland. We're going to win. Guys, <laughs> very hard fought game, but uh, Rusty and FIFA, but yeah, I got the win. 2 1, let's go! We are off. 2. There. Jim. To do some workout, it's absolutely freaking hot in here. What's the England score tonight, Tom? England, Denmark. Hmm. Uh. They'll probably scrape a 1-0 or 2-0, I think. I mean, Christian Eriksen is an absolute bother for all of Christian Eriksen. But, um, yeah, hard one. I think of everything, group stages are the hardest to get out of in any competition you do. I think it'll be a good game for Hopefully it is. It needs to be a good game. Right. Let's do it. I like girls, but I don't like curls. So. <laughs> oh, they hurt so much. Big man, look at the size of that. Oh, he used to be, he used to be fat, eh? <laughs> oh, that's okay. Swatting's are feeling good, 305 for five. Nothing too big, and then a single at 320, so very glad to be able to get the work done today. Very glad to get the 320 as well. Felt quite comfy. Nice to get used to wraps again, so we're just going to keep on pushing. Um, using a big uh, squat bar as well, so it's nice. But yeah, um, Luke's still down. He's down in London getting a recessed on his biceps, so fingers crossed, everything's still okay with that. But yeah, that's me done squatting. It's hot outside. Now I'm going to go home. Eat, chill, sleep, repeat. Thanks for watching, stay spicy. <laughs>